everyone and welcome back to my channel. So today I have a baby girl haul for you and it's probably the biggest one I've ever done. Uh, the last few bits that I've been buying since like I did my last haul um, are kind of tossed up and I thought I'd just do them in one big one. So I have some bits from the Essential One, H&M, Florence and Fred, uh, Mamas and Papas, and also some secondhand things as well. So that, I don't know where I'm doing this. That's five different places. So hopefully it will give you like plenty to look out for. So I'm going to start with um, some of the secondhand stuff actually, just to give you an idea of what you actually can get for really good money. Now in terms of secondhand stuff, I am a member of like a local buy and sell group on Facebook that's usually the best place to start in my opinion there's one that you can look at for just like next clothes if you're into that sort of thing there's some local so you can pick them up from your local area which is the ones that I prefer because then you know you don't have to pay extra for postage and things like that um and I bought a bundle for 15 pounds um that includes some Bowdoin stuff um next gap and I'm really really impressed I thought I would show you this is all by the way for her next summer so when she's like 12 to 18 months sort of thing rather than like directly now um but my most favorite little outfit and bearing in mind i've washed all of these and i haven't ironed them for obvious reasons um the first one that i really really like is this from the gap which are these bright little yellow shorts they are so stinking cute matched with this little kind of crochet top smock top and together i'm not really doing them very much just to sell my but together they look adorable and i'm just imagining a little, maybe she'll be blonde, maybe she'll be dark haired, you know, but a little girl like walking around these in these next summer, learning to walk and stuff and they are absolutely gorgeous so I'm really pleased with them and they're like pretty much like as good as new and I've given them a wash and they're in great condition so again that's the first lot from there. Then I've got this little vest top and this is just an H&M one that came with it so again she'll be able to wear that one, it's a bit warmer next year. Um, there's this little kind of vest onesie with a little lace collar which is really cute. I have this dress from Next which has just got kind of like a summery print all over it and that's like grey marl which is really nice. And then this one from Next as well. It's just a little pink. I think this is more of a top to be honest. She could wear it with just like a nappy underneath though couldn't she? And that's just a pink one with a little bee and a butterfly on. Then this is from, where are you from? This is H&M. Again, I love like the folksy print on this one. It's really pretty. And then this is Bowdoin, and it's distinctively Bowdoin, you can tell. Uh, baby Bowdoin with a bird print and matching little like pants to go over a nappy. This is absolutely gorgeous, I love this one. Um, I love the print, I love that it's grey as well, I've got the right thing for grey. As you probably know if you've been watching me for any stretch of time. These little uh, harem pants from Next, which are just a little like pink ditzy floral print and we have another baby Bowden set here um i'm not really oh here we go so these two go together so we've got the little top which has got animals on so her big brother will absolutely love it when she wears this because it's got a seal an elephant a flamingo and a zebra on and then it has matching little polka dot pants to go with it which is really cute and then this one which i think is absolutely gorgeous a blue polka dot one with yellow flowers on the bottom and again matching little ruffle pants there um look at the ruffles on the back it's so cute um and then this little dress from i think this is h&m yeah it is it's a panda dress a yellow panda dress what could be cuter about this and it's nice and like thin material it'd be lovely for summer and she'll look so cute in that and then to go with like those other outfits like you know some of the tops and stuff we've got a little pair of denim shorts from h&m and a little denim skirt 
which is from Next. So like I said, all of those were £15 and that's a bargain isn't it really when you think about it so i'm going to go into the next stuff in terms of like age order i think so the first things i have to show you are from the essential one and these are all brand new by the way the essential one sent me some things so i'm going to say that right now but i love them i've already bought some stuff before and i've mentioned it in a past haul uh because the quality is incredible it's so soft and they wash really well as well um and the first set is uh, these like sleep suits and they are a set of three I believe yes and the first one is a little pink one with a mint trim and cupcakes on and it says uh, little fairy cakes as sweet as can be um, I can't read that last bit my eyesight's going but that's the first one and the that's probably my least favourite out of the three but I like them all but they just keep getting better and better in this set and the next one is this one and it's a little white and um, green polka dot with a pink trim and a little, little ruffle down the side here it's really cute but my absolute favorite is this one I love like I've discovered anyway that I love like girly I like prints like floral pr prints on girls but not necessarily always like in pink so I love it when there are like colours like this which is like this gorgeous minty floral print sleep suit is absolutely gorgeous I oh, I love this one and that is my absolute favourite and I think these are all in three to six months I think these ones so not for right now but getting there so that's the first set I've got the next set is my absolute favourite. In fact, my friend Katie, who um, I'll link down below, I'm sure a lot of you follow her anyway, we're expecting within a week of each other mostly. Um, and she's having a little boy this time after having two girls and I'm having a little girl this time after having a boy. So we both have an addiction, it would seem, for like white, yellow and grey. So we, we have both got these sets and it's quite funny because we'll have to try and like time it so we can get the babies together wearing them or something um and i think i had these in up to one month let me check for you i always find it really hard finding the little labels on baby clothes to tell you how big they are you just have to look look down a leg here we go so these are in yeah up to 10 pounds these so when she's dinky and the first one is this yellow and white striped one with a little uh, cloud not hot little cloud and then my favorite 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 one is this one which is a white cloud print with a yellow trim and i absolutely love these i just think they're so cute and i can like dress her in them and match her to a nursery which is really superficial and pathetic but we've all been there we all like a good photo opportunity don't we and then the final set is another set of two and again i was a bit of a sucker for the floral print and mark really likes this one mark likes things with little like cutesy bunnies on or like animals and teddies and i'm all about the prints it's really funny like the difference in taste but he this is more his kind of thing he likes things like this so it has um a little bunny on and it says little one um again with the little frill here a little bows on the ankle so there's that one and then this was my favorite print and it's floral and it's a cream one with a pink print on this time with little light accents of green for the leaves which I thought was really nice so those are all the ones for the essential one and they are kind of all of the you know the, the more like babyish stuff like the sleep suits and things like that and now I'm moving on to outfits so I'm going to move on to the stuff from Mamas and Papas because I was sent a few things from the Alice and Wonderland collection and I thought I would quickly show you these the first of which and this kills me because it's really cute I have to I have to find like a nice event for it to go to when she wears this um and I'm not sure what size it's in I think 
it's 0 to 3 and the first thing is this little Alice in Wonderland dress and it is so cute oh my goodness I really really like this I uh, I love blue anyway I love blue on little girls um, and I'm hoping that she'll have blue eyes like her dad as well but it comes with a little headband and then this is the little dress I've taken some photos of these so I'll leave the link down below if you'd like to have a closer look at them and then the next one is this little top which I don't know if you can see um, and it has like a little Peter Pan collar and it's striped and on the collar it's a curiouser and curiouser and that comes with a little pair of um, striped pants which can also match this final one if I can get it off for you uh always technical problems there we go and this one says let's not be silly and it's the mad hatter um and again the pants pants will match quite nicely with that this is probably a little more bit more boyish i would say but i think she can get away with it i've not got a problem with putting a little girl in navy um but they are really cute the dress is my absolute favorite i have to say um and i like the theme i like the fact that she'll be wearing something from like Alice in Wonderland I think that's so cute and then the final thing that it sent me is probably my least favorite because of my pink issues sometimes and when I say that I mean like bright pink I'm not entirely sure um but it's definitely one for like photos and stuff and this is a pink tutu which you know the problem is with me I might not be a fan of pink but she may well be so who knows I know that little girls like to wear stuff like this uh, but I love the top it has Alice's face on sketched on with a little Peter Pan collar and I really like that so it's one of those we'll give it a go but I've got to be honest about it haven't I I can't just go oh I sent these and I think they're great because this is just slightly out there for me but we shall see um now next up are some things from Florence and Fred and I'm going to go through these really quickly because my battery's going and this is a long video again. Um, so the first thing is what actually prompted the rest of like buying all of this was that my mum and dad picked this up at Florence and Fred when they did a food shop and it's just this little romper which was £3 in three to six months and I thought it was really cute so I decided to have a look myself so thank you mum and dad and then I got the matching dress which is like the reverse print really so pink with white heart so um, again that was three pounds I got a pack of leggings so some mint ones and some yellow ones just for the summer months really like three to six months again and um, we are going on holiday in August so a few of these are bought with like holiday in mind um, I bought a yellow cardigan with a little crochet front just again because I'm a sucker for yellow and that was seven pounds again in three to six this dress kills me it's a little folksy one that's embroidered with little flowers and again that's three to six months and it was seven pounds and then the first little swimming costume it's got flowers on it's dead cute and i don't know again i love like blue and floral so she'll be wearing that and that was five pounds and so that's three to six months and then the final things i've got to show you i bought very recently and they're from H&M. All of these things you'll still be able to get, I think, online. Um, and the first one, which is, I think this is three to six months. Don't know the prices of these, unfortunately. Is this little dress, which is cream with grey polka dots and a little grey um, pocket there. And matching little bloomer pants. And again, that will be more for towards the summertime. In fact, I think this is four to six months because H&M have some weird sizing going on sometimes so that's those and then I've got these little pants these are like harem pants and these are six to nine months and I just really liked the floral print on these I thought they were really nice and they looked comfortable I had this little dress which has got kind of like a secret garden style print on it and I really liked the use of like green and stuff in this you don't see very many clothes that are green for girls and that is two to six months so when it gets a bit warmer hopefully she will fit in that I love these this is a set of two little rompers the first one is cream with little tiny strawberries all over it and the second one is a coral colour with white polka dots, so nice and bright. And then I have another pair of herring pants which 
are in four to six months just grey with a little ditzy pattern on them and the final thing I bought just to make her brother smile to be honest because I can dress her in this and he'll love it and it's this cute little unisex um, outfit which says my little tiger and then it has little pants with tigers all over it and a little tiny tiger hat and if you're having a boy they have a set that's got whales on it and I think the whales are saying like nice to meet you and that's all charcoal grey and really cute as well if you were wondering and then two things I thought I would show you finally one is this awesome awesome rattle that I bought from the milk collective I'll leave them linked down below and hopefully you can hear that but it's like a banana milk shaped bottle and it's really soft on one side and it says milk on the other and I absolutely love it and obviously like yellow it will go in here um, and then the final thing is the whisper um, I've seen loads of people with these at the moment and they it's basically like a white noise bear that turns its on or it turns itself on automatically when baby cries which I think is amazing and it has like textured paws so they're all like either crunchy or they feel different they're soft or make a noise and they're magnetic as well so it can clip to like a cart or a pram or a car seat and I'm really excited to use him. I think he's cool. And I like the fact that it's made with baby in mind. Like all of these like textures and colours are really going to like, you know, heighten baby's senses. So I thought he was quite cool. And that is everything. So thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time. Bye.